Hey guys, I may be a bit ill, but doesn't mean I'm gonna quit doing this. So welcome back what? to what? 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 What is this? Uh, oh. It is me, uh, Francois, Bowser's best Cooper's evil twin. And bitch, this is my recording. Ah, uh, now he's taken care of. Hello, au revoir, gentlemen. That was goodbye in French. Just kidding. I'm going to be here for a while. Now, I'm going to be commenting on this part because this pathetic little swine is going to be ill for the rest of it. Now, as you can see, like the pathetic noob he is, he is still in Tarzan's world. Jumping on here, boss. Ridiculous. Back in my town, we used to go around jumping on the pathetic swine and killing them in one hit. Because that is how the fledge do it. Whoa, ho, 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 ho. Please listen to me. I know the nesting grounds are secret, but I trust them. You see, I want to help them because, because, well, they need us. Okay. Did you get that? Wow. Uh, it is funny because Tarzan failed at convincing his parents because his daddy hates him. <laughs> I laugh at him in his pathetic daddy issues. See, at the moment you're thinking to yourself, is this a French accent or some sort of strange Austrian German combination? Well, neither do I know. But uh, as the evil twin of Bowser's Best Cooper, subscribe, rate, five stars. Uh, that, that, I, I don't know. I was collected in some sort of evil test tube facility. It was 1943. The war was almost coming to a close. And some sort of evil demonic figure thought, hmm, this is good. As you can tell, this is going to be a very interesting part where this urchin here, Gloom, tries to climb and jump stuff, and he's going to fail a lot, trust me. It is quite hilarious, but also pathetic at the same time. If you don't want to watch this video, you're forgiven, trust me. Sorry if I'm not talkative, there is a bit of lag on this video and, well, I, I just, I can't look at it. It's, it's so pathetic. Around this time, I already had the Oblivion Keyblade. Oh, God. He's taking his time, isn't he? Oh, God. Jesus, this is terrible, terrible. Hello, how is it going, Francois? What? What is this? Ah, I'm your evil clone, the Russian Meister that is, Olek. Ah, he's wounded me. My, my spine. Yes, I laugh at you and your pathetic baby spine. I'm taking over this recording. Hello, it is me, Alec. Welcome to the recording of Let's Play Kingdom Hearts episode 57. I am going to tell you about all this pathetic baby business that this man Gloom is playing. Sorry for killing Francois, but I, it is in my contract. I'm looking at this pathetic baby jumping he's doing right now. Oh. That is terrible. Oh, oh, he's returning Dalmatians. Back where I am. Back where I am from. We got them. We skinned them and we warned them to protect us from the coldness of the winter. And if you didn't have enough coats, you would die. Good. 
god, this is going to be a long video, isn't it? Ugh. So let me tell you all a little bit about myself. I come from Vashkrashnya, in the little town of Hoboputil. There, I grew up as the son of a deadly hunter, his name, Ralucio. He was some sort of Spanish immigrant. I don't know much about him, but he was a baby compared to me. At age seven, I had to fight him in a wrestling match to the death, as is all custom, it, as is an old tradition in the town of Mapushnov. There, I crushed his spine, his head, and all of his organs in one singular move. He learned his lesson for messing with me and taking my milk early. God, this man has to swing around all these trees. Back in Vodpushnyov, I just jumped around everywhere. Everywhere I could breach. And, oh, I, I, I didn't even need to swing. I jumped. God, this is pathetic. No. <laughs> I'm looking at the timer on this video. And it's actually going to be longer than 15 minutes. Jesus Christ, man. Talk about time, Wister. <sighs> wait. Wait. Was that outside? It... Oh, no. It is... It's my cousin. The... The evil... Oh... Oh, oh, oh god. Uh, hello? Oh god, not to you again. Hi, guy, this me. How is it going? Oh, uh, no. Oh, not you again. Hi, guys, I just decided to join you on this fabulous day. How? What are you doing? No, nothing. Yes, you're looking at some sort of scream of a game going on. What, what, how is it going? No, no, it's nothing. Dust, dust. Just, just leave it. Leave it. D are you hiding something from me? Oh, like, oh, don't be ridiculous, doll. We'll just put the what's it together. What, what is it? Kingdom Hearts. Oh, is it that game with all the fighting and the keys and the blades and the love and the heart? <gasps> yes. Sort of, I suppose. Oh, this is just gonna be fabulous. Is, is that Donald and Goofy? Yes. Disney characters. It's a combination between Final Fantasy and Disney. And who is that young strapping fellow you're playing at? I'm not playing as him. I'm just simply watching him play the game. With this character. Oh, come on. Stop kidding yourself, doll. <laughs> just, oh. You're not even touching the controller. God, games are so innovative these days. I should really get myself in on this theme. Oh god, um, I'm watching him play the game and commenting, and that is all. Well, that's it. What, what are those bodies down there? They're nothing that... Did, did you beat up your evil twin? No, that just... It just happened. There was heat of the moment, and uh, yes, it did. I... Okay, okay, I may have slightly, slightly beat him and broken his spine in one hit, but, but, who hasn't done that to the evil twin, eh? Look, look, all this infighting, it, it, it's just not fabulous, it, it's really, really not approved of, I, God, it's just ridiculous, but, God, you, you people. You know, back in our little town, it this never used to happen, you know. Well, what about the fighting and all the violence and the blood? Look, sure, that happened, but it was all in the name of fun. That that just looked plain on me, if I'm honest. You know, you can leave any time. Oh, I see how it is. You want to get rid of me so you can go around, swing around all the jungle with all this man in his fabulous red trousers. Whoa, 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 not cool, man. This kid is underage. 
Well, I wasn't talking about doing that. I was just admiring his taste in baggy red trousers. Gah. Uh, sure you were, man. Sure you were. Are you doubting me? I think you're fine. You insult me. I I'll be forced to hit you. It's like you could take me on, little baby boy. <sighs> Ugh, I have fought kings, queens, strange retarded relatives. I can take out anyone, especially little Nambi Bambi baby boy like you. Oh, it is on. Uh, oh, oh. You, you hit me. Yes, 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 I did. Now you learned your lesson. I'm bleeding from my. Oh, God, you, you punctured my heart. Well, now you know what you get when you mess with me, don't you? What? Oh, so much blood everywhere. I, I'm going into the light. Uh, look, look, don't go there, silly. God, you'll be fine. Let's just, let's just apply a bandage here and... Oh, God, he's dying now. God, whoever... You're still playing the game as well. God, God, silly Billy. Don't understand. But you killed me, my own lover. God, now that is just plain old ridiculous. I'm not your brother, I'm your cousin. This was established earlier on in the video, but you just had to screw up with that line, didn't you? Oh, and he's dead now, isn't he? That is just fan for contesting. Is, is there a phoenix down around here? I, I heard those tend to work. Uh, I don't know, he's dead. So I guess it would just be me on this part. Uh, it looks like it would be fun. Uh, let's, let's continue on, shall we? So, for some reason, this kid here is just swinging around the jungle. I, I find that plain old ridiculous, but uh, with the, whatever this, this seems to be common occurrence with this game. I assume it's some sort of uh, jungle simulator. Well, I will admit, while the environments look pretty, they, they definitely weren't like the jungles I remember visiting. They were, they were fabulous, exotic people. Everyone there was great. That... Oh, what, what, what's going on? Wow, secret chest. That is just fantastic. That is, that is, that has got to be some sort of innovative game design here. I've, I've never seen that before. I mean, granted, the only console I ever owned was the Philips CDI, but uh, you know, whatever. It's just, wow, it's gorgeous. Wait, Kerchak! Wait, Kerchak! Please! You don't understand. You don't understand. I, was only I was only trying to. Uh, a snake uh, slipped by. A snake slipped by. I see. Uh, I see. Uh, I see. Little gorillas, little gorillas, little gorillas lie. lie. Wow, this game is going for some sort of Tarzan theme. That is, that is brilliant. Now, um, in the space of that cutscene, I've, uh, I've, I've invited my friend over. His, his name is Greg. He's, um, well, this may be a bit weird, but he is, in fact, a dinosaur from the planet Venebulon 7. Uh, no, he's just coming now. Hey, hey there, Greg. Hello there. Oh. Would you like to join me in... They were just talking for some reason over this, this computer game. I Apparently it serves some sort of purpose. I, 
I don't know what, but uh, wh whatever. You, you get over there. Oh, hello there, gentlemen and ladies of the internet. I am Gregory. Now, some people appear to be confused about the fact that I am a dinosaur with the sophistication of wit of an aristocrat, but no, I, I just don't get it. It's, it's, it's common for me. On my planet, I'm actually considered somewhat of a dullard. Well, that is just interesting. Now, for some reason, at this current point in time, uh, this kid with those beautiful trousers is uh, swinging around Tarzan land with, well, Tarzan. There's some sort of plot going on with a hunter or some crazy stuff like that. I'm not very sure of it if my mom has died. I haven't been here since the start. I, I literally just got here. Wait, wait, wait a second. What, what are these bodies over there? They're, they're nothing. They're just, they're just some uh, stuff lying around. Did you kill Oleg? Well, only slightly. No. Oh, oh, man. Do you know how I am with dead bodies? I tend to look at them awkwardly, then I devour them. And... Oh, man. Why, why would you do that to him anyway? Come now. Come now. <laughs> what am I doing? What am I doing with these imbeciles? Last and gorillas, last and gorillas. I'll hunt down every I'll hunt down every them. last one of them. I'll track them down. I'll track somehow. them down somehow. I'll stake my I'll life. I'll stake my it. life on it. Hmm? Hmm? Hello everybody, Gregory here. Now, in the space of that sort of talking related scene, we've managed to dispose of a body. For some reason, We've lost, we've lost our good friend here. He went off on some sort of way. He, he's taken the body, and I'm pretty sure he's gone off to bury it somewhere strange. I apparently it's some sort of ancient Russian be, Russian burial rite. I don't deal with such trivialist things. Now, for some reason, our main protagonist, it seems to be here, is is fighting some sort of ancient monkeys type beast. I'm not sure what it's about, but. Whatever, you know. Uh, I, I tend not to uh, question the fact that there are some sort of bodies lying around in this place. Uh, there appears to be some sort of French-looking individual lying down there. It is me, France. What? Look, shut up, man. Do you want me to eat you? I'm very tempted right now, but you still appear to have some life in you, so I don't view it as fair game. There also appears to be some sort of dying child over there who looks like he wants to look at this game with amusement and joy, but he can't over the many plot contrivances and ridiculous things that happen. But what do I know? I'm only a velociraptor. Now, this appears to be some sort of jungle simulation game where your character seems to have the ability to communicate with wildlife that also appears to be wearing somewhat human clothing. It's at this time he goes around beating up what appears to be slightly corrupted monkeys. I don't get what's up with this. It appears to be an animal abuse game, but, uh, you know, whatever. I suppose it's a, it's, a gri it's a grimy sort of game, very dark, bitter, and very mean, but you know, the, the market seems to be going this way this, these days. The, it's all about the darkness and the grittiness, and weird facts like that. You guess why he's beating up the monkeys? Does anyone have an excuse? You there, dying boy. Do you have anything? <laughs> oh, oh, you just vomited everywhere on the carpet. Good God, man. Do, do, do you know how much Febreze is going to take to get the smell out of here? Ugh, fifth. 
We're going to have to take at least three showers after this. I... I do believe that is Donald and Goofy from my childhood. I, I spent many days watching the House of Mouse in my state. <laughs> that... That is just truly surprising to me. I'm shocked at the... The fact that this seems to combine some sort of fi fantasy setting that is somewhat final and Disney. That is, is rather astute and amazing. Oh, oh no. I'm getting a text here from... Ah, oh, it's my mother. She wants to see me urgently. Look, look, look. M mother, mother, I, I, I can't talk to you right now. I, I'm rather caught in business. I'm talking over a computer game. What do you mean, waste of life? That, that, that this, this is important business. I, I, I've got to do this. I owe a friend a favor. And look, just, just calm down. You don't have to come over it. No, no, no. Look, I'm not staying at that address. No, no I'm not. No, no. You can see me from outside. What? Okay, look, look. Well, calm down. Okay, okay, I'm going. I'm going. Fine. Goodbye, everyone been fun, but I have to go deal with a very crazy one. Goodbye.